Okay guys, sorry this is moving so much. We are about to do something awesome that I looked at. We're going to do the diamond nail on this nail right here. So, what I'm going to be using, I'm going to try to do this really fast. IBD gel, uh, builder gel. I'm going to be, my camera's moving a lot, I'm sorry. I'm going to be using this uh, raspberry gel polish because it's a little bit darker than this pink right here that's in here. I'm going to try to like match it. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on the outsides of the nail with the dark, um, with this dark gel polish, kind of like fade it inward, make it, you know, blend it out, and then I'll show you right when I come back. Oh, sorry. Okay, so see what I did there? I just like, I'm just blending it inwards. You know what I mean? Kind of, so the outsides are like a darker color. Okay, so the outside's going to be a darker color. And then I'm going to take my, well, I'm going to go ahead and um, cook this, <laughs> cook this in the lamp for about two minutes. I'll be right back. Okay, so you're going to want to get you one of these. This is a nail form. Um, go ahead and measure it to the size of the tip of the nail that you're going to be using. And you're going to cut like a diamond shape out. You're going to cut whatever type of um, emerald or ruby or whatever shape that you like. As long as it fits on the top of the nail surface. Um, cut that out with your awesome little scissors. That's what I'm going to do. And if you don't have a nail form, you can use like the plastics that come with stickers, the hard piece. Um, you could use that. I've been seeing a lot of ladies using that plastic because when you um, put it in the, the the lamp, it doesn't melt the plastic or anything and what you could use whatever the gel will not stick to and stay. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to use this. I'll be right back. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Okay. This form had lines on it, so that made it so much easier. I'm sorry my camera's moving. If you could see how my camera is, like, set up, you would freak out, like, really. But um, it's working anyway, so it doesn't matter. So, see how this diamond fits perfectly on this nail? Like, the size of it? Okay, well, we're going to be using the opposite side, so you're going to be flipping it over since... This is what you're going to be placing as the surface. This is going to be the surface of your nail. This is what's going to make it look like a, um, a, a diamond or a stone or an emerald or whatever you want to call it, a gemstone. So what we're going to do is we're going to get me a brush first of all. I don't have a brush out. So find your gel brush and I'll be right back. Okay, I got my brush got my gel. I'm going to put some gel on my nail. And you want to put it like in the center. Kind of like build it up a bit. This you can use like on your accent nail or whatever. This would be so cool. It's like a dimensional nail. As soon as I seen this, I was like, oh my gosh, that is so awesome. I want to try it. Okay, so I'll set that to the side. You have your little mound. See, you have like a good amount on there. You're going to turn this over. opposite way sorry kind of press it down because what it's going to do is it's going to imprint the shape on there and then go along the sides fix up the gel with your brush 
Okay, so I went ahead and I fixed the gel on the sides and all that. Can you see? And then I'm going to put it in the lamp like this, okay? Let's check it out. Let's try it, guys. I'm doing this as I'm doing this video, so that's why it's kind of like fast. So, I got this idea because I saw a video by Denise John a few months ago or a month ago or something like that. She was going to do a nail like that, and I was so curious. And then the other night, um, I saw this video by nail nail nails and she did a video on how she did it and I was like oh my god that is so awesome so I started um, doing some research looking you know up some more videos and there's a lot of foreign videos um, out there and I say foreign because it's language I don't know how to speak and um, I'll go ahead and link those videos below too um, you can watch those videos even though you might not understand what they're saying or be able to read the information but you will learn how to make it if you pay attention to each step that they're doing. So I'm going to go ahead and link those videos below because I did not come up with this on my own. Um, but I thought it was really cool. And I don't know if any of you had seen their videos. So I wanted to go ahead and do that with you. And I wanted to try it out too because I thought it was really, really cool. So yeah, I'm still waiting for my nail to cook. And I'll be right back. So what we did use after all. I'm just going to go over what we used. Um, builder gel. We used a uh, gel polish. Um, I used, oh, um, the nail form. Some scissors. Of course, you're, you can get a lint-free wipe with some alcohol spray. Isopropyl alcohol to clean your brush and your brush. Gel brush. Um... That's it, guys. That's all it takes, you know, to make this design. So, I'm still waiting. Okay, it just came out. And I kind of, like, messed with it right here. Oh, it didn't set. But, you get what I'm saying, right? I think it sets better when you use the plastic. But do you see what it would have came out like? And then it's kind of like a diamond. And that's how you get that. I think that was such a cool idea. Let me fill it in and see if I can do it with a plastic. I'm just going to trace um, the one that I already had. That way it'll come out the same shape. And then I'm going to lay it. I'm going to put a little bit more gel and then lay this on there and put it back in the oven to cook. No, I'm just kidding, not the oven, but the um, LED lamp. Oh my gosh, guys. Look. OMG. We did it. We did it. Look how awesome that looks. Oh my gosh. That's so awesome. So I use this plastic. This comes between my canvases from, you know, the canvases that I used to paint. It's a plastic sheet and this came in handy. You can probably put whatever shape you like, but this is so cool. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Love you. God bless you. And thank you for watching. Bye.